We considered a lot of um, farm animals before we got chickens. We decided on chickens because they're small, they're very low maintenance. Uh, the roosters are certainly noisy, but they're mostly fairly quiet animals. And there's just not a lot of high maintenance to do. We weren't exactly experienced with the animals, so we decided to go with something simple that had uh, a big payoff. In addition to taking care of the chickens and selling their eggs, processing the meat and whatnot, uh, I also watch people's dogs, mostly people up and down the street. Though there is one person off near Essex whose dogs I take care of. I get about 10, 15 bucks a day, depending on what I have to do there. So it's nice money, it's easy money, and it's something I enjoy. Uh, for my future career-wise, uh, my immediate goal is to be a veterinarian, and then hopefully I'll make enough money that I can retire, you know, get more chickens, some cows, goats, uh, maybe ducks, farm some fish, and just retire and be a farmer. And uh, two weeks ago, um, the shepherd that raises um, border lesters uh, found uh, or heard her out in the field. She thought all of her breeding was done for the year. And uh, she was just very loud. And uh, she went out to the field to see. And she was in the wide open field with her and her brother. She has a brother. Um, and she was only three pounds. And she was too little to nurse from the mother. So, um, this uh, shepherd called me and asked me if um, I would like to be able to take care of her because she had to go away for the weekend and she could not take care of her. And I said, oh, absolutely. So she's been a bottle baby since and she lives in the house with me. And uh, she would have died if I hadn't taken her because there was, she just couldn't, she couldn't nurse. But now she's, um, prob well, she's probably doubled her size now. And she's very sweet. I've reached the top and had to stop and that's what's bothering me. I want to be a man, man cub, and stroll right into town. Now Phil, when he comes every day, he feeds the little one out in the barn for me. But he's down to two bottles a day. She still gets hers about every three hours. That little tail, she's just so happy when it's time to eat. Bad.